Welcome to Linux Self Tutorial. Today I am going to show you how to record your terminal session by using a command called script and script replay. There are two commands. Script command will record your terminal session and the script replay command will replay your recorded sessions. In previous video we have discussed with the tool short term. It is also a tool which is used for terminal recording but here this is a command which is pre-installed in every Linux distribution which is also used to recording the terminal session you don't need to install any package to record your terminal because it is a command which is already pre-installed in your system so you can simply run it to know about any command in Linux system you can type what is space under the command name here here is in script now hit enter here it will show you the description here this command is used to make type script of terminal session and type what is script replay and hit enter this command is used to play back the type scripts using time information now let's start recording our terminal session so run the command script space and we need to give a file name which is going to be stored the data for our record session we can give any file name then the new file will be created under your current directory now I will type test record dot txt after pressing enter button the record will be started and the data will be stored in this file the file will be created and the data will be stored in this file after stopping the recording now hit enter to start the record here you can see the record is started To stop recording, type exit and hit enter. Now here, type ls and enter. Here you can see the file will be created. Now let's view the content of this file. Vim space file name and hit enter. Here you can see these are the data so stored while recording your session. Now close the file. After finishing the record, we can able to add more content to the file by using the following command. Now type script space hyphen a space under the file name. Here this option hyphen a will be used to append the new content to the file. Now hit enter. Now the recording is started. Now type anything you want. To stop the recording, type exit and enter. Now let's view the content of this file. Vim space file name and hit enter. Come to the last line. Here you can see these are the new content will be added in the file. Now close the file. To replay the record, now let's start the new record session. So now type script space hyphen hyphen timing equal to give any name you want. I will give play dot text on the space the new file name sample record dot log here we are creating two files this file will store the 
data file recording this is the file which will capture the timing on the store sheet into this file this timing file will be needed while replaying our record session so we have to create this timing file now hit enter now the recording is started Now the recording is stopped and the file will be created. Now type ls and hit enter. Here you can see this is the new record file which will capture the timing delay while we type in the commands in our record session. Now let's view the content of this file. Now let's open this file. Vim space file name and the enter. Here you can see this is the timing delay for each and every keystroke when we are typing. Now close it. Now let's replay the record session by using script replay command. So type script replay space hyphen hyphen timing equal to this file name play dot text space and this file name sample record dot log now hit enter now the recording is started here you can see it is replaying the recording session Now the recording is handled. So this is how we can able to record our terminal session by using script command and replaying the session by using script replay command. So you can able to start record your terminal session. That's all about for this tutorial. Hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Thank you for watching.